My name is Ken Kimball. I'm from South Florida. I moved to Flagler Beach, which is Northeast Florida, uh, right after diagnosis because I wanted to relieve some of the stress uh, that came with my job and, and came with big city living. I had the surgery, I had radiation, and my next step would be three or four different drugs, including chemo, including um, hormone deprivation therapy, and it was just too much for me to consider. And Hippocrates had always been on the tip of my tongue. Friends had talked about it, I knew where it was, I had to drive by it, but now I had a reason to come here. So I came here to, to change my lifestyle further, to, to claim health. The Comprehensive Cancer Wellness Program has uh, introduced me to a whole other concept of living, of thinking, of healing. It's based on the fact that my thoughts and my energy has a lot to do with what's going on inside my body. I mean, this body I've always taken care of. But that energy body, yeah, okay, I read about it, I knew it was there, but I never caressed it, I never appreciated it. And that energy body evidently was trying to get my physical body's attention. Just the way I handle myself, the way I act, the way I think, is having a lot to do with the chemicals in my body and how my body's reacting. The answer for everything is our immune system and how we can get it stronger. That immune system knows what to do, our cells know what to do. We're the only ones that have been tricked into not knowing what to do. We've done, we've done Whoppers and McDonald's and French fries, and, but our cells already know what to do. They know how to protect us, how to heal us, how to make us safe. And the word comprehensive in the cancer program is just that. It, it's all inclusive. It's just not a pill. It's not a chemical. It's our food. It's our air. It's our water. It's our thoughts, even more so than anyone would believe. It all needs to be clean and pure, and we'll become clean and pure. So now I, I go to the beach every day, put my bare feet in bare sand, I watch the sunrise, take a picture of it, try to get in the ocean every day, I rebound every day, I, which I had a rebounder sitting there, but it wasn't being used. All those things, and, and I get in my exercise without, without a schedule. I get in relaxed now, I get a sauna in every day, at least one sauna. I try to take a nature walk, and, and actually walk up to the largest tree I can find and talk to it, it sounds odd, but you don't have to even say any words. You can just kind of put your hands near it. You can, you can kind of feel it. We're all connected. This, all this wasn't here just for us to chop down, for us to destroy. We're just, a, we're just part of it. There's a, a spirituality to everything. There's a sacredness to everything. And that's you know, one of the gifts of, of my challenge, my C word. It changes your mind, it changes your focus, change your priority. So now I see life, each day now, so much more valuable. It feels great, it feels fresh, it feels new, it feels like, like almost like being a kid where maybe the first time you crossed the road you weren't supposed to. I found a duck pond and you know, I found a big tree I can climb and I found things I never saw before. It's almost embarrassing in a way to have waited this long to find it, just a little bit. But the joy of finding it, it just overwhelms any like resentment for not finding it sooner. You just have to find it. That would be a tragedy if you left here without finding it. So yeah, I'm right there with it.